fingers crossed. I'm trying to start it. What are we up to, Wardy? Trying to see if I fit in my old gear. Standing by. Look at that. 1990. Still fit. That's an accomplishment. Yeah, that's not bad. So we're gonna ride. Uh, tell me a little bit about what you're riding right now, if you don't mind. Uh, it's my uh, old factory 125 from '84. So uh, and it started. <laughs> so it'd be interesting. It's gonna be kind of cool to, to feel it out again. I haven't ridden a two-stroke or 125 since probably 1987. So. Should be kind of cool. Little red. David, what's the tire pressure? <laughs> yeah, exactly. Uh, what do you, a special what, set of tires that what do you, match special, special and stagger perfect. Uh, just go high. <laughs> you go tire high, pressure is enough. <laughs> don't high and don't lift. That's it. Okay. World's going out. God, you gotta love these open faces. class. <laughs> <laughs> Yep, I remember the slippery seat. <laughs> I, used to, I have to get gravel and put it on there. Yeah, it's got a good pull. It's like a little, a little lean on the bottom, like yeah, yeah, yeah. But it's just, uh, you just have to be a gear lower. Right. And you think you need to be. <laughs> I mean, but it hooked, it seems like it was hooking up. Yeah, pipe's hot. Yeah. I remember burning my leg on that thing quite a few times. Yeah. That's pretty cool. Wow, that's pretty, that's really cool. <laughs> bring back memories though? <laughs> yeah. You can tell by that smile. <laughs> <laughs> 
<laughs> yeah, the uh, when was the last time you rode this bike actually? Well, I rode a 125 um, in 88 at the Donations, but it was a production bike. Yeah, but I'm so 84. 84? Last time. Last wow. national. Wow. Yeah, it's crazy. Foot pegs are so small. Yeah. You can just so just like minor adjustments, it'd be a little better. Like the clutch and stuff. Sounded, it sounds amazing though. I mean, sounds pretty good, huh? Sounds ridiculous. It's got a little bog. I mean, it's got a. Uh, it's got like a when you go wide open, and then hit that jump. Yeah. Then when you get on, it's got nothing. Yeah. I can hear it detonating like yeah. like it was just at the. It doesn't like uh. Get fuel back in it fast enough. Dial it in. Be ready for hang count. Yeah. <laughs> Just a little more tweaks here and there. Yeah. It moves around so hey, much. It <laughs> it's like a total couch. Yeah. That's perfect for you. Yeah. Perfect. I mean, it feels good. Like I, I wish there wasn't so much water in the berms. Yeah. Because they're all <laughs> gooey. That you yeah. could get in. And like you can tell this thing wants to like settle yeah. right in the berm real good. Right. Right. But it's, there's not. It's just yeah. full of water right now for most of them. But yeah, the last night killed it. Oh, but right now, if you had three guys on here, you'd have a... Well, we got a bunch of bikes. Where's Pinker? You got a helmet? <laughs> yeah. Yeah, we need about three or four bikes. Where's Nick? Get a, yeah. he, he's on his way here, actually. You put him get, on one. Yeah, yeah, yeah. We, this is enough for everybody. How many laps do you guys want to do? Nothing leaking? Yeah, power valve. Leaking little little power valve? Well, always did, though. <laughs> Mine did, constantly. Yeah. I mean, but is that the same gasket that was in there? Yeah. Probably. Yeah, yeah so... Yeah. That's not bad. Doing pretty well. They used to leak with brand new ones in there. Imagine uh, <laughs> about 40 years later. Yeah. It's pretty amazing. I mean, it sounds just absolutely Yeah, ridiculous. once it hits the pot, like yeah, it has yeah. a really good, like right now something's missing on the bottom, whether yeah, the yeah. power valve's working yeah. or not, it's, it, you really gotta be in low gear. Yeah. To where before I remember you didn't have to be. Mm -hmm. You could just have that little bog spot, but it was always right there. Mm -hmm. Right now it's, it's not, you gotta yeah. give twice, yeah. three times more. More RPMs to stop it from falling off. Well, I'm gonna call Norm Bigelow, see what he says. Yeah. Yeah. Get Norm out of here. Yeah, doing it right. Then what jetting should we put in this thing? Yeah. What, what gas is in it? Uh, I don't know, Pingree, Pingree Special. We got some good fuel for it if it's trying to ping. Yeah. yeah. It's got enough for a few more laps. It's, it doesn't ping on, uh, no. Only the only place is star like when going across there when I hit the jump. Right. And then when I land, you can like when you shut off, you can hear it detonate a little bit, and then there's nothing when you give it just bolt. I nothing there. It. Yeah, I nothing. heard it bolt. So a little, I, little lean pop over here. Yeah. So it's it it's awesome. definitely probably it could be a little lean on the top or I don't know what it's, it's, it's not running the bowl out of fuel though, by no means though. But it could be getting close though, because yeah. that's when I get in the air and shut off, it's either right. floating and then exactly. That poison bowl. But it's not, one? it's not, nothing's coming out the bottom. No. It's comfortable bike though. Nice and fleshy. <laughs> well, it was made for you. <laughs> yeah, it was. It's been a long time since I've touched both feet on a bike. Yeah. <laughs> Feels good. Yeah. Both feet are on the ground. Yeah. Usually on my 450, I'm like, this. I'm like, barely touching. Cool.
is so fun on that bike yeah. what, it's what, like what do you i mean what i mean like right now the brake the rear brake's so far down it's like if he could if he did a couple adjustments and uh the front brake is like dead is it's it? like pulling nothing's happening yeah, I think no i know that's what i mean but it still stops but if it had everything it worked it's just like the way like i said if the little berms weren't full of water the way it like when you hit you get in there and hit it just it just stays it's like a couch you know even that whole sweeper when it steps out it doesn't do a it just like absorb, like it just absorbs it. Yeah, it's such full Cadillac. Good, yeah, it's such a good how, feeling. What, how's, how's the motor versus what you remember? When it pulls, it pulls. Just like, jetting sounds a little. Yeah, but it's like it's not. Uh, I've ridden. Uh, Ayrton has the 125 Honda, like stock two strut. It feels like an 80. I mean, it's like you're waiting for it to go. Where this one, you can tell it. You it know, you can feel the power. You can feel the pull. Um, but. Yeah, if it was just a little bit that didn't have that bog, because I had to go down a gear lower a lot just because to keep the rev up so it didn't bog. And then, but uh, did it bring you back a little bit? I mean, your style looks exactly the same as it did in '84. <laughs> the bar, I think the bars do that. The bars, you the bars bring like, your elbows in and it makes you go like this. Yeah, you like, just off the back, kind of pinning it and wheeling. It's like, well, it's just like you're not up over the front of the bike as much as like the four. You know, the, yeah. Like if you were on a 450, you'd be tucking that thing, right? Yeah. This thing, it seems like you sit in it, and it, it's like riding a jet ski. <laughs> it's like you're just letting it go, like waiting for the weight, you know. And then when you get on the brakes, it just like settles down and then you're turning in the you're expecting it to like even the sweeper here to keep tucking and it, it just kind of like absorbs it wow it's pretty cool yeah. hey you're pretty good you're gonna race or, <laughs> about racing or? hey that thing would be fun a mammoth just yeah. like in the two-stroke class i don't think you'd ever shut off but no. <laughs> it wouldn't make it though i don't think it'd make it up there